hi hello friends today in this video we are solving two mark important question for inter second year students so this is my first video on inter second year mass b two marks problem so please subscribe to our channel and share this video to your friends those are inter second year students so without any late let starts our today's video about two marks problem so given that problem this is first problem find the center and the radius of the circle x square plus y square plus gx plus 8y minus 96 is equals to 0 so we have to carefully observe this problem first we have to understand the problem what they given and what we have to solve so they given find the century we have to find the century and radius of the circle so clearly mention that in the question we have to find century and radius of the circle we have to find century and radius of the circle with this equation x square plus y square plus 6x plus 8y minus 96 is equals to 0 so let's solve this problem solution we have to write first given that equation given that equation that is x square plus y square and plus 6x plus 8y minus 96 is equals to 0 so this is the equation they given in the problem so now we have to compare this equation and this problem we have a formula that is compare with x square plus y square plus 2g x plus 2fy and plus c plus c is equals to 0 so this is an formula of this is a formula to find century and radius of any problem so we have to learn this formula and this is a formula of this problem and to any problem to find a century and radius so given that problem so compare this x square x square plus y square y square in this gx in formula 2gx and 8y they get 2fy plus 96 and it is a constant it is a values so then we get to compare this formula we get that x square x square but 2g x value is 6 is equals to 6 and uh, y value is 8 so 2f is equals to 8 and then g is equals to 6 and 2 transpose to right side that will become it is multiplying when transpose to right side it is become divided by and so that is 2 1 za 2 3 za so g is equals to 3 and this is also f is equals to 8 2 is multiplying the f the right 
when the two transport to right side two multiplying become divided by that is 8 by 2 so 2 1 the 2 4 the so f is equals to 4 so check this one so 2 into g is equals to 6 and g is equals to 6 by 2 when 2 is multiplying the g it become when we transport to right side it will become 6 by 2 so that is 3 and f is equals to 8 by 4 is sorry 8 by 2 that will become f is equals to 4 and then we we get that g value and f value so then we have to find its sentry so to find sentry the formula is c c is equals to minus g comma minus f so this is a sentry of formula sentry formula of sentry so minus g we get the g value that is 3 and so it will become written as minus f so minus g this is an formula of minus minus and g value is 3 3 comma minus minus and f is equals to 4 so we can write as minus 3 comma minus 4 this is a sentry of c and then they find that given in question find the radio or radius of circle so to find the radi radius of circle we get we have a formula to find radius that is so sorry radius to find radius to radius r is equals to this is a most most important formula to find radius g square plus f square and minus c minus c to find radius we have a formula that is r is equals to g square plus f square minus c so then root g square value so we are finding g as 3 and find it f also that is 4 and c value is c means it's a constant value so in a, every equation they given a constant value that is c so this is an value of c that is minus 96 so let's write here so c is equals to minus 96 in every equation they given a constant so that is the c value of this problem so g square that we are uh, finded as 3 so 3 square plus f as we know that 4 so one second yes 4 that is 4 whole square and minus of minus and minus 96 c value is minus 96 minus 96 so then root 3 3 all square 3 square that is 9 plus 4 square that is 16 and minus into minus 96 minus into minus that is plus 96 plus 96 so that is root that will become 121 so 121 root 121 so the square root of 121 that uh, that is 11 so this is radius of this problem so we are successfully finded 
this is n century for century value and this is r value radius value so we are successfully find it century and radius of the circle so you have so yes r value is 11 and century value is minus 3 comma minus 4 so please subscribe to our channel and this is my first video on second year problem so this is a very little bit of explanation i will definitely check my and improve my explanation with you today so please support me and subscribe to this channel for second year class and second year class in first year class or 10th classes and share to this video to your friends and you have any doubts please comment on my comment section